What's happening, guys? So I got this question on Twitter using the hashtag AskFurious. A new thing that I'm doing if you guys want to have a question answered by me on Furious Talks or at least get my opinion on something, just tweet a question with the hashtag AskFurious. Pretty, pretty simple. And uh, got this question the other day. What to do when you're not allowed to take protein powder with you on a holiday? Well, I'll tell you a couple things. First of all, why can't you take protein powder with you on holiday? Second of all, why would you want to take protein powder with you on holiday? The key word in that is holiday. I mean, if you're going away on a holiday for like a whole year, then I understand that you might need some something to aid you if you are trying to achieve some kind of goals or, or whatever it may be. However, most holidays, let's be realistic, are about a week or two weeks or something like that. In which case, they're called a holiday, so you should be taking a break from supplements. That is the perfect time to completely take a break from all supplements. Second of all, when you are on holiday, you're probably eating some really good stuff. And in that good stuff, you're probably eating protein. You can opt for extra amounts of protein when you are eating that good stuff. For example, you know, you're going out and you have some kind of, you know, steak with this and this and this. Add an extra skewer of shrimp. Add an extra chicken breast. Add, get a bigger steak or something like that if you need that extra protein for whatever reason. But from my experience at least, when I'm going away on holiday, I'm eating at least three, four times a day and you know, sometimes they're, if I'm, for example, going in all inclusive, you got a buffet, you got a lot of protein there. Another thing is, it's a great time if you're going, for example, to a country you've never been to, that is an absolutely fantastic time to discover new kinds of proteins that you've never really ate before. Like, you never really considered including them in your diet because, well, you were like, oh, I just never thought about that. You know, there's different kinds of seafood, different kinds of meats, different kinds of um, even soy and stuff like that that you can include in your diet as protein. Um, you know, different ways to incorporate eggs, different, you know, different ways to incorporate a lot of things. And I think that, you know, when you're going away on a vacation, that is the perfect time to at least discover it, try it. You know, sometimes it's not good, it doesn't taste good. But amongst all of this, amongst trying everything, you are actually hitting your protein quota for the day. At least most of the time. And if you're not, and if you are not, who the hell cares? It's a week. Even if it's two weeks, if you're not hitting your protein quota every day, you might hit it one or two days and then the rest you don't. Who cares? Do you think it's really going to affect you in the long run, in the big picture? Remember, holidays are a time to relax, forget about all, you know, all of every workout and supplements that you take on a regular basis. It's time to step back detox from all those supplements and get back to your protein powder and and all the other shit when you get back home focus on good food when you are away don't I mean if you really want to maintain some kind of physique or you got some kind of goal just focus on good healthy food when you are away but to actually get all that protein in really isn't that hard you don't really have to rely on whey protein I mean most of the time when you were growing up, you were eating protein all the time and you didn't even know what whey protein was when you were a younger kid. You didn't know what it was, but you were still eating protein all the time and you never really considered whey protein. Obviously, you're not really considering, you know, muscle goal goals and, and, you know, trying to develop a physique necessarily when you're younger, but still, you don't need whey protein. Nobody ever really needs whey protein to be successful with their goals. There's very easy solutions. Egg whites, eggs, steak, chicken, seafood, so many options out there. Look around for them. Don't panic. Enjoy your fucking vacation. Love you. Ask me questions at hashtag AskFurious. Stay sexy, stay hungry. Get laid.